Hello children, welcome to our world through English. So today we are going to uh, start our new unit. So previously we completed third unit and with the great stories and in the previous class we discussed about uh, magic of silk, how the beard has been turned to a finest silk in China and we discussed about the story and we enjoyed a lot, right? So today also we have a beautiful play. So previously we have the play and today also we have a beautiful play to enjoy this very much. So it is especially about Tenali Ramakrishna. We know about Tenali stories, Akbar Birbal stories we know and the Tenali Ramakrishna stories also we, we know about this, right? Krishna Devaraya, Sri Krishna Devaraya and Tenali is Khotiyo and uh, there was many stories under these two people and we love to watch these videos also what is having in a lesson we are also having a story in our YouTube you can get Tenali paints a horse in a, uh, in a video form so that you can enjoy clearly so this is uh, a play uh, shows how Tenali Raman was a wise man in the kingdom uh, that will give a beautiful narration here Tenali paints a horse Tenali paints a horse so let me give an uh, introduction about this this is a play and the characters will come here Raja Raja he is nothing but Sri Krishna Devaraya we know that Krishna Devaraya and Tenali Tenali is the character next Kotia first coat here and second third and fourth so four coat years will come here so this is the play now we are going to start what is here let us read him Tenali Raman was a poet and a jester in the court of King Krishna Devaraya of Vijayanagara he was famous for his wit and intelligence his interesting play provides this interesting play provides an example of his wit read the drama and answer the questions that follow so here we have a drama or we can call a play that shows the wit and humor wit means nothing but a comedy wit uh, means fun or comedy so our knowledge about of Tenali Ramakrishna how Tenali Ramakrishna became a, a wise man intelligent man in the kingdom of Raja Sri Krishna Devaraya that we are going to see in the form of play and a drama let's see how he was very very famous so characters are written already Raja Krishna Devaraya the king of Vijayanagara, Tenali Raman, Pirate and Justin the Court, first courtier, second courtier, third courtier, fourth courtier. So these are the four characters, uh, four plus two, six characters we will get in this play. So scene one. One day, Raja Krishna Devaraya and his courtiers watch as an artist shows his paintings to the king. The king and the most of his courtiers are impressed with the paintings. However, one of the courtiers, Tenal Raman, look displeased. So what happened one day? one artist an artist came to king and he is showing every beautiful uh, art uh, uh, art which was made by him and he's showing this is the uh, beautiful diagram this is the art so he was showing every art every art so when it was showing then all the courtiers were saying yeah this was wonderful art this is a beautiful art this is a wonderful art and everybody saying yeah wonderful a beautiful a lovely one so everybody saying these are all a beautiful 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 but Tenali Raman was not happy he was unpleased unpleased and everybody will think what happened to this man why he was not happy by seeing the art of this great artist king also very very happy king felt very very happy with that art which was made by the artist and he was very very pleased and happy with the artist but Raja saying that that is really a beautiful painting so Raja saying for the artist saying hey, you are a beautiful painting you made a beautiful painting I can almost feel the peace of the village scene you are a very talented artist here is a 
bag of gold for you. We shall be very pleased if you can stay on at our court and make more beautiful paintings like this. So immediately what happened? Krishna Devaraya seen the art and paintings and immediately saying yeah these paintings are very very beautiful paintings i loved these paintings very much so every art every painting shows the village nature and the beautiness of the village and i love this very much please take your reward and he's saying that take the bag of gold and do more paintings if you possible stay with us be in our court and draw more paintings and make more paintings and make us more happy. So Krishna Devaraya I was very very happy with the art and paintings of this man who came to the court of Krishna Deva Raya. Artist, your highness is very kind. It will be an honor to paint for your majesty. So this artist was saying that, yes, thank you, my dear highness. I am very happy to get reward. And I was very, very pleased. And I was very, very pleased to have to draw more paintings for your majesty. This olden days, what happened, for example, if the kings were in the court, many people will come, some people will come and they will sing songs. And the king will say, oh, wonderful song and he will give his garland and he will give some of the chains and bracelet and rings so whatever he is having he will give so to get all those things many people will go to the kings they will sing songs they will make poems on king and they will write stories on king and they will create a beautiful diagrams for uh, paintings arts like here here we are seeing an artist came to king and given his paintings then immediately he received a bag of gold bag of gold let's see Tenali I don't think there are so much good paintings at all I am not saying I am not feeling that these are the beautiful paintings I didn't feel these paintings are beautiful paintings so Tenali is saying this dialogue immediately Raja was saying that how can you say that I think they are perfectly lovely and King saying hey what do you know I know very well about the diagram paintings. These paintings are lovely paintings. Tenali, you are not saying true. These paintings are very, very beautiful paintings. Then Tenali, for one thing, where is the other side of the two men? And you can see only there one side. For another, there was the where was the face of the cow. So you can see the picture here, children. So Tenali Raman was saying that as by showing the picture, you are seeing the picture and saying this is a beautiful picture and which was showing the village nature and the beauty of village. But where is the two men other side? We are seeing only one side of the men. What about other side? What about other side? We are seeing only one side. Where is another side? And again he is asking question, there is a cow in beside of them, but we are seeing only the back of cow. Where is the face of the cow? And how can you say, this is a lovely painting, this is a beautiful painting ever. How can you say Raja? Then immediately Tenali asked the question to Raja. Now Raja is answering to Tenali. What an ignorant fool you are! Everything cannot be painted. You must imagine the bits are that are missing. So Raja was saying that, hey, you fool! I thought you are a wise man. I thought you are everybody feeling that you are an intelligent man. Then you are a big fool, Tenali. You are a big fool. Why? Because we have to imagine painting. Painter won't paint all. Artist won't paint all. Why? Because we have to imagine. Everything cannot be painted. We have to leave something. Then the missing one, we have to guess. So the missing one is, we should guess the missing one. We should guess the missing one. Tenali was surprised and shocked for the answer which was given by Raja Krishna Devaraya. So what made 
Tenali and how Tenali was going to respond when King called him as ignorant fool. When King called him as ignorant fool, how Tenali is going to respond for King Ward? See here, I bet I can paint better than that. Well, I could if I had pain, if I had the pains. Then immediately Tenali saying that, Oh Raja. I can paint better than this if I had paint with me. What he said, I can paint better than this if I had paint with me. Paint with me. Then Raja saying, okay, I am going to bet with you. I am going to bet. I bet a bag of gold. I bet a bag of gold that you cannot. If I will give you the paints and the paper you may also take leave from the court for a month if at the end of the month you bring me a painting that is as good as the one we saw today i promise you a bag of gold and the title is king of artists so now what happened here now there is a bet between tenali and King Krishna Devaraya. What they are going to bet here is we can see that King said, Okay, there is a bet. If you draw a beautiful painting than this, I will give you a bag of gold. Take one month of leave. I will arrange you paper. I will arrange you paintings. So draw with it. Maintain a big, a give a beautiful paint painting and bring back to me after one month if not if not he's saying that i will give you a title of king of artists and one bag of gold and one month leave take and draw a beautiful paint and come back after the month then immediately tenali said yes i agree after one month after a month i will show you a better painting than that one immediately the bit has been started then tenali said that definitely i will draw a beautiful painting than this and I will come back in the next month then Ali Raman said these words the courtier started smiling thinking that he would lose the bet they know Tenali Raman cannot paint at all Tenali looks at the jiggling courtiers angrily and walks out all the courtiers are mama mustering and whispering and saying that this man cannot draw because we know Tenali doesn't know how to paint so definitely he will lose the bet and definitely king will win the bet first courtier you have really caught him out sir he thinks he is the smartest person in the world second courtier he has really painted himself into a corner i had like to see him get out of that one rajas i would not be too certain of that he is really very clever then immediately courtier was saying that raja raja you are a very smart man why because tenali was feeling that he is an intelligent man in the world and he is the smartest man in the well, you made him to bet and you caught him my dear king you are very intelligent man and another quote has said that definitely he will lose the bet king definitely he will lose but Raja saying that no 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 I hope that he is something in his mind he is something in his mind let's see what happened in the second scene the month a month is over the courtiers are waiting eagerly for tenali to bring his painting they are smiling and whispering to each other so 30 days has been finished one month has been finished now all they were waiting the court was ready raja was ready courtiers were waiting where is tenali where is tenali one month completed one month completed where is tenali ramakrishnan where is tenali ramakrishnan then all they were waiting for tenali raman raja so what do we do today sir the day has arrived when tenali raman shows his you his painting where is he it's late and almost time for lunch so all they were waiting for tenali raman 
and it is already lunch time so half day finished and all they were saying that king raja raja this is the day what we waited and with when telani raman will show his painting he is not coming to the court maybe he is uh, he lost the bed perhaps he is so busy with his painting that he has lost track of of the of the days perhaps his painting is so good that he cannot bear to part of it so one is saying that maybe he was busy in painting another painting maybe he is saying that maybe he not painted anything so that he lost the bed so everybody was talking something about tenali raman and raja saying that well i cannot wait any more somebody should go to his house and tell him that he has lost the his bed and the bag of gold so all the people were waiting and the king said no 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 i can't wait any more i can't wait any more so somebody go to tenal rama's house and say that you have lost the bed and a bag of gold then fourth court yeah it is only fair that he doesn't make good his boast he should pay a penalty i feel he should pay the court a bag of gold then immediately court is saying that not only that king raja not only that he has to pay penalty to the court because king ordered raja ordered to come to the palace but he hasn't come till now so he has to pay a bag of gold to the court to the court because he lost the bed and he was late so he has to pay the penalty Indeed sir I agree sir that he should yeah ha ah, there he is he seems to have brought it but it was covered with a cloth so finally what happened you know when they were discussing all these things so when raja said somebody go and court said he has to pay penalty at the time our tenali was coming into the court by covering by covering the painting and he was entering into the court Now see, then Ali comes in with two men carrying a painting covered with a sheet of cloth. When then Ali gestures, the men lifted the cloth to display an empty canvas. The painting has only a few covered curved strokes of a black and right hand edge and a few green lines at the bottom below it. So what happened, you know? So finally, then Ali Raman arrived to the palace. When he arrived the palace, what happened? He finally he came with the painting how was the painting you know the painting is like this so an empty canvas nothing was there so he was a block like this an empty canvas and with the green paint and after this here he made a small thing that we can see in the book also it was like this so he came with a painting like this and he shown to king raja and all were surprised what he has shown and everybody looking at the painting and he said this and the painting is that the painting has a few only curved strokes of black on the right hand edge and a few green lines at the bottom below it then immediately tenali was talking this good afternoon sir see what a beautiful horse i have drawn it is a magnificent black stallion with a white star on its forehead look Look at the polished leather saddle on it. Hmm. I wonder if I should have rain trials like that. So immediately Tenali came to the court and showing the picture and saying that, my dear King Raja, look at the picture, beautiful horse with a beautiful forehead and white head on the forehead and a beautiful saddle and everything was very very beauty, my dear Raja. Look at this beautiful painting. Then immediately all the courtiers and the Raja were surprised. prize and as, as uh, amazed what is in the picture and he was explaining many things and he has a doubt what he was talking where is the horse he has shown only the tail and he was showing about uh, saying about the horse and the beautiness of the horse and the saying that the horse was very beautiful and a black stallion and a white star on his on its forehead and he is saying many things 
and he's saying many things then what is there in the picture then immediately Raja is saying what is this I can't see I cannot see a horse this is very insulting you are trying to make me a fool of me there is nothing on this canvas then king said hey Tenali are you making me as a fool what is on the canvas nothing on the canvas there was nothing there was no horse I couldn't find I can't see even a horse head there how can you say are you making me as a fool are you trying to make me as a fool then Tenali was looking at Raja and saying this well you are the one who told me that we had to use our imagination when we look at paintings imagine that the rest of the house is just outside the canvas grazing grazing at some lush green grass look you can see you can see the edge of its tail in the corner now Tenali revealed the secret Raja Raja you only told me what you have told me that we have to imagine and that everything cannot be painted you only said me Raja everything cannot be painted we have to imagine we have to imagine so Raja I told you everything what the horse was doing the horse was very beautiful and stallion and star on its forehead and look at the picture here it was on back of the green grass it was having food so imagine the back of the gauge then immediately Raja was surprised Raja was surprised and saying that whoa you old rascal you have got the better of me minister where is the bag of gold give it to Tenal Raman the cleverest man of in my kingdom cleverest man in my kingdom so Tenali Raman said that what Raja told to Tenali he given back to the Raja and he said he drawn only the tail and he said everything about the horse what the horse was doing how the horse what the physical appearance of the horse so he shown he said everything but he drawn only the tail and said to Raja Raja we have to we have to imagine everything so immediately Raja said you old rascal you old rascal you have caught me I know that you are the cleverest man in my kingdom immediately he called hey come on who is there come bring a bag of gold and give it to Tenali Raman the cleverest man in my king of my kingdom and he said he is the king of artists so that is the end of the story a drama Tenali paints a horse so let me conclude by explaining again all the story what happened so one day Tenali Raman and the king Sri Krishna Devaraya Krishna Devaraya was in the court one day one artist came and showing all his paintings one by one then Raja said oh a beautiful poem. oh a wonderful oh awesome painting so he was praising the artist so one day he shown the painting and there in the painting only two men were standing one cow was there but the artist the artist painted only one side another side was not appearing and the cow was turning back and there was no face of the cow then immediately uh, Tenali said this is not the beautiful painting this is not the beautiful painting why because there is not the second where is the second of the men's and where is the face of the cow then immediately king said you fool ignorant fool ignorant fool in painting can be shown everything cannot be painted everything cannot be painted we should imagine the rest of the things we should imagine the rest of the things then immediately Tenali Raman said oh if I have paints I will draw better than this I will draw better than this then immediately King said okay I am going to bed with you say I am giving you paints I am giving a paper and I am going to bet a bag of gold and the title is king of artists take one month leave and maintain a time take your own time 30 days and draw a beautiful painting and come back to me then I will see how you are then immediately all they decided that definitely 
Tenali Raman will lose the bet. Tenali Raman will lose the bet. He is thinking that everybody feel that Tenali, Tenali feeling that he is the smartest man. He, they are saying, court is saying that Raja Raja, you caught Tenali because Tenali was feeling that he is the smartest man in the kingdom. He is the smartest man in the world. So definitely you caught him. Definitely he will lose the bet. So one month completed. The time has been finished. Everybody waiting. Where is Tenali? Where is Tenali? All were saying that Tenali lost the bed. So he is not coming to show his face to Raja. So he is in the home. Then at the time. At the time, Raja was waiting and said that, okay, send somebody and say Tenali lost the bet and inform him to pay the penalty. Some court has said, not only that Raja, he has to pay the penalty. He has to pay the penalty. Then only he will be, he will be in the kingdom because he is not obeying the word of Raja. He is not accepting the words of Raja. So let him be there. Let him be there. He has to pay a bag of gold as penalty at the time Tenali the, the cleverest man intelligent man a wise man coming into the court he came to the court uh, by covering a painting covered one and he said okay lift then they will removed when they removed they have seen the picture like this then immediately Tenali started oh here is a beautiful horse with a stallion and a beautiful star on its forehead and a beautiful saddle and a beautiful things and I want to maintain a tail little bit beautiful but I thought this was very wonderful what he's saying you know I draw the face beautifully and I draw the body beautifully but I thought the tail was not satisfying for me because I want to make a little beautifying for this tail then the king got angry hey fool are you going to make me as a fool are you trying to make me as a fool what is in the canvas nothing was there are you making me as a fool then immediately Tanali said oh ho my dear Raja my dear Raja you only told me what you had told me that everything cannot be everything cannot be painted so we have to use our imagination we have to use our imagination you only told me you only told me what painting artists cannot paint all we have to imagine by showing the picture when the two men was not appearing side and the cow face was not appearing then you only told me Raja that everything cannot be painted then now you only saying that I am a fool oh then king said you old rascal you are intelligent in my kingdom you taught me a lesson you are really a wisest man in my kingdom hey bring the bag of gold and give the bag of gold to Tenali the wisest man in my kingdom and he is the smartest man in my kingdom and I am very happy to have you as a gesture in my kingdom my dear Tenali so that is the end of the story Tenali paints a horse okay children I thought you enjoyed the story and the drama if you want to watch as a movie you can type the same word Tenali paints a horse in YouTube and you can get a, a clip a video clip on basing of this story it was really awesome you can enjoy that not only that many Tenali Ramakrishnan and uh, uh, Sri Krishna Devaraya funny clips and um, videos were available um, uh, animated videos animated videos were available in YouTube and you can watch and you can at the same time you can get uh, uh, intelligence uh, morals and you can get knowledge so that is the end of the story Tenali paints a horse so thank you for watching children and don't forget that you are uh, in at home so revise every lesson day by day which lesson you have been not completed previously complete the lesson and come back to every lesson so come re if you watch all lessons every lesson is interlinked so every part was linked so don't skip any part watch every video and you will get every lesson detailed in explanation so then you can understand the lessons clearly and the grammatical part clearly so this is the end of Tenali paints a horse in the unit 4 a reading so thank you for watching and meet you in the next class stay home stay safe until then take care bye bye